Welcome to another edition of Safe Diving Frequently Asked Questions. In this case, we have a diver who asked about having bloodshot eyes after diving. Have we ever heard of this? Yes, we have. And it's not that common, but it's not uncommon either. What happens is divers, typically those who can equalize very easily, in other words, without even needing to pinch their nose, sometimes neglect to equalize their mask. And then what happens is the mask exerts tension on the eyes and eventually bleeding occurs in the conjunctiva or the white part of the eyes. And the bleeding can accumulate around that colored section of the eye called the iris and it can really look very scary like a Dracula movie and we call it subconjunctival um, hematoma. And this can be treated fairly easily by an ophthalmologist, usually only requiring uh, cortisone drops. It usually clears within two weeks and uh, it's quite common for divers to be able to continue diving after about six weeks. So as long as your vision hasn't been impaired and you get the right treatment, you should be back in the water in a fairly short time. Just remember to equalize the mask as well as the ears. The nose pocket is there for a reason. It isn't only so that it keeps water out of the nostrils. It also is to allow you to equalize your, uh, your mask as well as your ears. And you might also want to consider a smaller volume mask. In other words, one that doesn't require as much equalization or has a softer skirting. Thanks for the question. And until next time, safe diving.